Are you feeling sleepy at your work? Or you cannot be concentrated when studying? Well, you may work in a warm posture. Most of us do not realize the effect of a good posture. We observe that people usually sit in a comfortable way when studying or resting. Some may bend down on the desk when using phone. Some people may even lie on the sofa when using computer. But have you ever thought about how your posture will affect your health and daily life? Is the most comfortable posture means the best posture? Well, actually, our muscles and bones work together to balance the stress and weight produced by different postures. If we do not sit properly, stress will distribute to the warm position and cause pain. Inaccurate sitting and standing posture can lead to muscle fatigue and lack of concentration. Disease like postural kyphosis and long term pain can also cause the bipolar posture. In this video, we would like to see whether students are familiar with group postures by interfering them with questions. We also decided an experiment on how different postures can affect our concentration. Posture for most people is a familiar concept but hard to describe in words. There are thousand views of posture in a thousand people's eyes. Everyone has their own perspective. Now, we interview some people to describe their understanding to posture. The first question, what is posture? How you sit or stand? The way a person sits stands, walk, and etc. What makes you the most relaxed? Second, what do you think as good posture? A good posture, mm, maybe you sit up straight uh, or stand straight. Yeah. It be physically healthy, like it shouldn't leave any adverse effect on your muscle, nor should it be harmful to your skeleton. And then I think a good posture should be appropriate and aesthetic in that certain situation. The third question, do you think posture affects mental performance? Why or why not? I think the relation are just converse. I think your mental attitude is, will affect your position instead of the position that affects your attitude. Mm, definitely. In my opinion, one's posture would affect um, one's feelings. If the people sit or stand in an uncomfortable way, it might make him feel unhappy as well. In order to further study the impact of posture on people, we conduct an experiment concerning how posture affects people's concentration. We invite nine students to participate in this experiment. First of all, we find an article from newspaper, and we divided all participants into three groups. Each group will listen to the recording of this article in different postures. Group 1 sits straight up. Group 2 slouch. Group 3 put their head down on their desk. After listening, they need to answer eight questions about the article to test their concentration in different postures. What are their feelings in different postures? Which posture did you choose in the experiment? The second one swatch. Third posture. How are you feeling? I feel the questions is a little confused because I think the speed of the recording is faster than my brain works. And when I was high down, I feel sleepy and I can't focus myself on the, uh, what I'm listening. Let's take a look at the experiment's results. From the experiment's results, we can conclude that different postures will affect people's concentration. According to a related study of postures and brain activity, where people's chests are under stress, it would affect the oscillatory activity of brain, causing the decrease of concentration of people. 
To make the result of our experiment more rigorous and persuasive, we continue with the second experiment. We download an app called Attention Training, which requires players to click the specified square in the order of the numbers and records the time players take to complete clicking all squares. There are eight participants in this experiment. Each of them completes the game three times in three different postures. After the game, we compare the data and found that most participants spend less time completing when they sit straight up, but spend more time when put their head down. By searching related studies of postures, we can also find that other researchers would conclude that a different posture would affect the cognitive performance of people. Remember to have a good posture.